Good morning, Table Mountain Worship Team. I am really proud of you guys. You guys have been killing it out there. Uh, the last couple of weeks, I've basically not been around, and you guys are just knocking them out of the park. So I'm um, very much to be grateful for. Thank you so much. I'm really excited to uh, to invite you guys to my place March 10th from 4 to 7. We'll have just like a party. Um, I'm hoping to do like business stuff via video so that way we can just kick it and not have to like have a speech about rehearsal times or anything. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to make a bunch of turkey and rice, uh, have some drinks there. So if you feel like bringing something, bring a side or a sweet, that'd be cool. Um, repertoire, the liturgy is finally out. So it is time to finally get into repertoire. If you've noticed that ever since we kicked off planning center and repertoire, we've had very few songs in there. Um, the reason for that was because I don't want to control every little aspect of the repertoire. I want to kind of open it up to a community thing where we can, we all kind of kick in ideas. Um, it is worth noting that the sending songs are the hardest ones to find. Green songs that, you know, have with them a like a great commission, you know, go and make disciples of all nations, you know, establish the work of our hands, these kinds of things. Green songs are the hardest ones to find. The sending inv or gathering songs are the second ones second most difficult ones to find and the more multicolors it, it the song has so you know lots of songs have lyrics from the bible that's great that's yellow um the but the more different colors they have the more multifunctional it is and the more likely it is to actually use those with again the end goal of all the songs being formation of the people we want to we want to make sure the songs that we pick the lyrics of them form people spiritually that's that's the whole thing that that the new thing's all about so <clears throat> with that um, forming people, the way to check your songs is to get the lyrics out and turn the music off and don't have any kind of builds and things that kind of influence that. Just read the words just like that right off the page. You know, may our sons and youth be firm in their roots. May our daughters be pillars in the palace of truth. Just read it out dry. Make sure those words form people. Um, ideally looking for green songs, songs that send people out, that commission them into doing something. Yellow and red songs are the easiest ones to find. If your song is all yellow, all red, very little else, it's going to be hard to use it a whole lot. Um, but that I would, the sooner we start getting those ideas in, the sooner we can get them into planning center and start making our sets a little bit more diverse. Resurrection Sunday is the last one in March. March 31st is our Resurrection Sunday celebration. Um, that is going to be more catalytic than formative. Um, that's a, that's a sun, Christmas and Easter are tend to be the moments where we have people in the room that we're not going to get back to be able to form them week after week. And so that's a good moment to, to be catalytic with our set. I would like to do an extra rehearsal because we have extra stuff to rehearse. So I want to add a rehearsal and then basically treat those two rehearsals like our normal, you know, Thursday night, Sunday morning, so that on Sunday morning we can get through the extra stuff. So the goal at the end of the second rehearsal is to be ready to just walk up and go and do it and execute. Um, so those songs will be coming out soon. Um, there's going to be a new challenge to fast. Um, I'm going to challenge the church, but I would like to start with us. Uh, that there's a screen fast one hour in the morning. It's massively powerful. It will affect your life in great positive ways. Honestly, that should launch in March, like March 1st or maybe March 10th. I don't remember. Early March is when that should launch so that we kind of wrap with the whole Easter celebration stuff, the, the Resurrection Sunday stuff. I've noticed a, a, a weird thing in Planning Center. If you're looking at like the music, right, you go into the date that you're up and then you click order and then you click the very top triangle, not the one near the top, the one at the top. That one has the, the playlist where you can listen to the music, right? Um, but if you if you switch dates and then you click that triangle, even if you got to the correct date, it will show you an old playlist. There's a little blue button that says load new playlist. So that's tripping some people up. So watch out for that. My door is open to you with Planning Center. Please hit me up with any kind of questions you got. Um, I'm really proud of you guys. You're doing great. And I'm looking forward to stuff moving forward. Talk to you soon. Ciao.